So, 2019 Nissan Altima. Anything with the electronic parking braking module, you generally need a computer to uh, release the motor to push the piston back. I'll show you a way to do it if you don't have the computer. You use a regular brake caliper tool or C-clamp if you don't have it. Nothing with the notches like this because we're not actually going to be twisting this at all. We're just going to be pushing it straight back and we're going to manually move the uh, motor apparatus back here. So put your brake caliper release tool here, a number five Allen key <coughs> to release both screws on the top and the bottom of the parking brake module. I already took the bottom one off. And you will rock this back and forth. So you get the motor off and we're going to emulate this spline gear here using i believe it's 25 no t45 uh star spinning it in the clockwise direction you spin this a little bit you can then push it back spin it again a couple more times Push your piston back. Just keep alternating, spinning a little bit, pushing a little bit. Of course, same rules apply. You need to take the cover off the master cylinder to relieve the pressure. And you can actually push this back by hand. Start to get tight in the back once you get to the end. Take your tool out, place your C clamp, use a small screwdriver to tuck your boot back or lift up on it to relieve any pressure and make sure that's tucked back nice. And that's it, your brake caliper is pushed back. Now, what you're going to want to do is take the motor, gently rock it back in place, and if it doesn't line up, you can actually twist this a little bit to catch the spline. And after you get it lined up like that, the assembly is the reverse of the disassembly. So you'll just take your torque screws, place them back in, and tighten them down, and then you're ready to reassemble after you have your pads on.